welcome back to my channel or if you're new around here i am waffles with layla aka layla hanoon if we want to be a bit bland but in this video we are going to be doing a weekly vlog with a bit of a twist in the sense that i'm going to film a what i spend in a week as a 24 year old gal living in london now i make this video with no means to brag in any sense because let's put it like this i still live with my parents and that says a lot i am literally just filming this video just out of interest for the many people that have shared interest in me filming this video but to give you a bit of context and a bit of background i'm 24 years old i used to be a diagnostic radiographer but now i am a full-time influencer slash content creator slash youtuber slash whatever you call it don't mind me just editing away here so my weeks can get a lot busy and this week in particular is very realistic and what I do and what I tend to do week to week. The reason I still live with my parents is that London is extremely, extremely expensive. expensive. Current moving up plans, there are zilch, maybe next year potentially, hopefully. It's because of my situation where I've been employed by the NHS and now I've been switched over to being self-employed full time that I have to show proof of earning and everything to the banks and loaners to be able to get a mortgage. Me and Armando are thinking of buying a house. We don't want to rent. And so we don't find the pressure of trying to move out so quickly. But that is not what this video is about. It is what we are spending in this week currently in London, which I have lived in London my, my whole, whole life. life. Just to put out there also, different parts of London are more expensive than others, but where I live, I am like central and I'm in the middle of everything. So I can go to one part of London and the next part of London in the space of 30 minutes because I have good transport links. Um, but you will see that throughout the week. I am just about to head to the gym and then I'm gonna be doing a weekly food shop. It is a Monday, but I didn't get a chance to do it on a Sunday, which I would usually do my weekly food shops on. But my gym subscription where I live in London is 26 pound a month. So that is the first expense we are essentially spending today, heading off to do a leg session and I'll meet you guys up afterwards. up from the gym finished up with my leg session it went pretty well i really enjoyed that definitely is valuable to have a gym subscription and especially that my gym is only like five minutes down the road so right now i am just about to head to tesco to do my weekly food shop and we'll see what that comes to shop and I spent a whopping £38.48. I picked up a few items which I wouldn't regularly pick in my weekly food shop. For, ex for example, the shampoo, the hair conditioner and the hair mask. I just picked those up because when I was having a shower yesterday, I realized I ran out of shampoo and conditioner and didn't get the chance to wash my hair. So I'm excited to wash my hair with those products. Also, I picked up this Milky Way Popping Candy Magic Star Chocolate Bar, which I haven't yet tried and I've always wanted to try it. I saw it on the counter and I was like, that's going in my basket. Anyways, I am going to make lunch now, which I'm feeling a tempeh and cauliflower barbecue cheesy wrap for my post-workout meal with some pancakes. So of course, I'm going to try this Milky Way Poppin' Candy chocolate bar now. Did we just hear that? They taste really nice. Reminds me of my childhood really with that Poppin' Candy. Love it.
good morning. It is Tuesday today. I've got myself a pre-workout snack. Literally this morning I've got myself dressed. I've been doing a bit of editing and just watching some YouTube. Today's plans consist of basically eating out. So we will be getting public transport, which the prices have risen in London now, which is amazing not um but we will work it out by the end of the day how much i accumulate throughout the day in terms of content today it is literally filming this youtube video and my manager has sent me some briefs over to have a review and look at so i will be replying to her whilst i have my little pre-workout snack my snack actually matches my gym fit for today which is so cute i've got this like green color on with some beige leggings and a salted caramel cookie. These are my favorite cookies, honestly. These and the gooey filled ones, microwaved in the microwave for around 20 seconds with a bit of ice cream. Delicious, absolutely delicious. back home after seeing the lovely Leah at Ugly Dumpling which was very cute by the way did you see the cute little dumpling that I drew to be placed on their wall which is a common theme in that restaurant apparently I thought it was super cute and a good idea the dumplings were delicious and so were the tempura aubergine um side option that I went for as well I'm currently sat in my car because this morning I actually drove to the gym and parked it outside, well, in the nearby area. And to put it simply, I just was too lazy to walk to my gym. So I'm just going to drive home now, which is literally a five minute drive. I know, that is that is quite lazy, I know. Um, and I ended up going to Glossier, which was influenced by Edgem. She said there's a cookie butter lip gloss at, that tastes like Biscoff although she didn't taste it, she just licked it. Um, and I was just like, I need that in my life. So we've got the cookie butter lip gloss on my lips. And for the foreseeable future, I'm gonna leave the totals of what I spent today on the screen because I'm just gonna rest up and chill for this evening, gonna get some editing done, and then it will be a new day tomorrow. Wednesday today, and it's been a productive morning so far. We've been working on a few bits which I want to bring out, which hopefully should be soon and come into action. I have also packed for Paris, which is the suitcase down there, because I'm leaving for Paris on Monday morning and I got a bit excited and just packed everything this morning. I tried on all the bits and all the outfits that I wanna wear whilst out there, so that's all prepared and organized. Today and tomorrow, I'm not really gonna be filming as such for this, video because I'm filming two separate videos. So today I'm doing the Burger King review as London now has an all vegan Burger King in the Heart flagship store of Leicester Square which is very exciting so me and my mum are going to film a video there today and then tomorrow I'm doing a TikTok viral what are you in a day type video. Um, so yeah not much spending going on other than the transport today and also the Burger King bill. Right now I'm going to be heading to the gym and then essentially the Burger King is going to be my post-workout lunch. <laughs> Clip of the 
dog. Oh, it's Clipper. Hello. Me and my mum have just finished up from the Burger King, which you can see the logo in the background a little bit there. We're actually on the way to Whole Foods store because I need to buy bits for tomorrow's video filming TikTok foods. But uh, I mean, I've already uploaded the review, so definitely go check out the review of me and my mum trying out the burgers at Burger King. But yeah, we're gonna set ourselves in a coffee shop because I actually need to upload it today. I'm just putting on my shoes by the way because I'm heading out the door pretty very soon if that even makes sense pretty very soon um yeah so I didn't film yesterday because like I said I did the TikTok video so I pretty much stayed in all day didn't really um spend much other than my gym membership as per but on today's agenda we've got a meeting with my gym shop manager Lizzie we are going to be meeting up at Megan's in Parsons Green which is like 40 minutes away from where I am um, and we're just gonna have a little discussion, catch up, get to know each other. So I've had my breakfast and everything, this is more like a coffee date sort of thing. Um, I think Megan's do like a, quite a few vegan options so we'll just see what's there when we get there. Um, but after that I've got a PR event for Coco Organic which essentially they're a coconut yogurt brand much like Nush except Nush primarily uses almonds. Um, and we're going to a spin class. What's new? I feel like spin has taken over my whole life. It seems like a lot of these like um, brands love a spin PR event. Um, but yeah, it should be fun because I'll get to meet everyone again. Um, and hopefully have a great time without my legs being completely destroyed because spin completely takes it out of me. Other than that, that is the main plan for today. Um, and then I think I might be catching up with my sister and mum afterwards, but we'll see what their plan is. I don't have much of a plan after those two main things. My room is currently a mess because I think I already mentioned I'm packing for Paris. Um, so I was, you know, I just got excited and I packed like what I'm wearing on the first day that me and Ashley are traveling and then my big suitcase is by here it's only for four days and i've got a suitcase for almost like two weeks that kind of size <laughs> right so i'm gonna take these rollers out i don't know if they're gonna be good or not i mean oh that's that's not bad perfect we love a bit of a roller moment um so yeah essentially i'm all ready to go now heading out the door and i'll catch you guys up with lizzie Mopper, right? That's right. Wow. Well. Tuna smile. This is Lizzie. Hey, go hey. <laughs> I've got myself this vegan protein bar which is on our goodie bag. I'll probably go through with it when I get home. But I'm gonna meet up with my sister now at Batty's Park and say bye to Bye bye. Yes. Hello. <laughs> so we are back home from the Coco Organic event and back home from actually going to the park with my sister and her babies. I'm gonna be making dinner for us soon. She felt like some truffle fries. So we're gonna make a big portion of truffle fries and something else to go along with it. I don't know yet, I haven't really thought of it. She was just like, make me dinner and I was like, okay. <laughs> so I opened up the package that Coco Organic gifted to us at the event and it's got a selection of goodies in there. I was a bit peckish um after the event so i did peck on the protein bar the free soul protein bar which tastes like a mars bar actually and then also i had the ginger shots but i'm gonna have a proper meal now because 
that's definitely not a meal. Uh, and along with other bits like their actual yogurt, their kefir milk, um, and also some granola, like this sin sindo, I think it's called. And basically it's like a probiotic, so it's got live bacteria in there and you just consume it every morning. So I'm gonna try it, but if it tastes nasty, it's going to my mum. She can stand that stuff, but I definitely can't. And some other little goodies. I also then received a parcel from Misfits um, for their new mint chocolate flavour. Now they are doing an event next week but unfortunately I'm not going to be able to go because it's the day that I come back from Paris and I come back at 3pm and the event starts at 1 so it's like unfortunate but uh, they have sent me a package to try out which I'll probably try out tomorrow um, but other than that I'm going to make up dinner and so I'll catch you guys tomorrow. Hi guys, it is currently Saturday afternoon and, it, and I'm in the Sunny Hyde Park because it's gorgeous weather and actually we've got a quite a hectic evening so I'm having a chilled afternoon. I'm currently with my sister and her babies and my mum. Um, we're just about to have some lunch, walk around the park and then I'll probably be heading home to get ready for this evening. Um, hello, good evening. You are talking to a very glammed up Layla right now. It was a very quick transition between the park uh, and coming back home to get ready. I really have to rush out the door, as always, to meet Lola. Then we're going to go to Covent Garden where we're going to have our dinner, which I haven't really explained, but I'll explain along the way because we're just about to go, go, go. Outfit check. I'm currently with Lola. We just ordered our food, and the man was just giving us like a brief history of the restaurant and where the uh, like menu comes from. It's basically a fusion of Indian and Chinese, which sounds incredible. So we can't wait to get the bits and pieces. I also didn't explain that this is uh, like a PR gifted meal. They actually just messaged me two days ago and was like, "Would you like to come down?" And it came really in handy because me and Lola were planning on eating out anyway. So. It's just the perks! Influencer! Yes! Food has arrived. We have the vegan mock chicken, the veg gyozis, which I think they're called momos here. Um, we've got the fried cauliflower, cauliflower popcorn, sticky veg, broccoli, and some rice. And then I think Lola's waiting for her duck, but I can't wait to tuck in! I seriously didn't explain this well at all, but this was our pre-dinner meal before our friend's birthday party, which was hosted at Hindo Bingo, I think it's pronounced, but you'll soon see, and it was a lot of fun. And so was this food. It was incredible. Wow. Yeah. Oh my god, insane. We have the vegan sizzling brownie. How insane does that look? Really good. You can just smell it. Oh!
Sunday morning from a very quite tired Layla, let's put it like that. I arrived home yesterday at 3am, which I am not a party animal guys, the party life is not for me. I was so disorientated this morning, I only really got 5 hours sleep because my body alarm clock woke me up at 7am, hurrah, um, actually is that 4 hours sleep? So I'm just very tired, I'm staying in all day i'm not budging <laughs> i might go on a little walk just for a little refresher but other than that i've been eating my meals and then i'm gonna head to bed really early today thought i'd conclude this video up it was a weekly vlog in in the form of what i spend in a week hopefully it was very insightful i've done the total amount which was 173 pounds rounded up that doesn't include things like my Netflix subscription, my car loan and other little bits and pieces. It's literally just what I spent in the week. I do consider myself to be very fortunate to still live with my parents who have a house in London and I'm very grateful to live here as well for the many opportunities that it brings to me and the friendships that I have here. But yes, did we enjoy this what I spend in a week? Was it insightful or was it just... Layla, you live with your parents still, you really can't make a video like this. Anyways, thank you for watching. I'm actually going to Paris tomorrow, so behind me, which is what I'm blocking, is quite messy down below. I'm going to sort it all out, rest up for this evening, and then I'll meet you in Paris.